the most common thing I tell students who are coming through in the ambulance service and, and certainly something that we'll be uh, telling the students coming through the, the bachelor degree is, is one, to be very professional, they need to dress professionally, but the big thing is, is respect. So they need to treat their patients with respect and the patient's family with respect as well. And the most common saying we use is treat the patients like you would like to be treated or the way that uh, you would like your family members to be treated and that's how you should be treating all patients you come into contact with. Yeah, I guess a couple turning points ever since uh, grade one, even right up to grade 12, I wanted to become a teacher. Uh, I, I couldn't get into teaching at the university, so I, I got into nursing, expecting to do that for 12 months and, and then go back into teaching. I thoroughly enjoyed the nursing uh, here at CQ University. I did my degree here, thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, whilst I was doing my nursing, I uh, then did a first aid course with the ambulance service just talking to the paramedics there and, and listening to get going out in lights and sirens. I, I sort of got a bit of a taste for it. I became a volunteer with the ambulance service whilst I was finishing my nursing. And when I finished my degree, I went across and, and then did my training with, uh, with the Queensland Ambulance Service. Um, but the way I see it, I've come in full circles. I'm, I'm now back at the university lecturing again. So I'm doing teaching, which is what I originally wanted to do throughout my whole uh, school life, I guess. Uh, I guess two things in terms of, of my work, uh, I was uh, paramedic of the year, voted paramedic of the year back in 2006, so that's something not many people would know. Um, secondly, you know, I've flown out, of, jumped out of helicopters as part of my job, and uh, I'm a huge uh, Parramatta supporter, Parramatta Eel supporter with rugby league, so it's something I try to, try to hide, especially when Parramatta's not doing too well in the rugby league. So.